Hi guys, this is Daniel from FND. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use stable diffusion in Google Colab in a very easy method. So let's get started. First, you need to go to Google Drive and, and sign in with your Google account. Then go to this link. I have given this link in the description. And then click on copy to drive. Then click on runtime and change runtime type. Make sure the hardware accelerator is in GPU and click on save. Scroll down. First, you need to set up. Click on this icon to run this cell. Wait for some time. After that, scroll down and run this cell as well. This will also take some time. Again, scroll down and run this cell as well. Import torch from diffusers. Import stable diffusion pipeline it takes two minutes to run this cell then scroll down and run this as well now we can generate our images so you need to add a prompt so this is the prompt a photograph of an astronaut riding a horse you need to edit this prompt and click on this run cell then it will create a new image. If you want any reference for prompt, you can go to the website called lexica.org. You can see many generated images and you can click on the any image and you can copy the prompts from there. So I'm gonna copy this prompt and paste it over here. And you can also edit the prompt if you want. You can also add additional words, then run the cell to generate the image from the given prompt. So this is not a very good looking image, but you can get my point. So this is a very easy method to create a generated images using stable diffusion in Google Colab. Let's try another uh, prompt. I'm going to simply give anime boy comma 8k. Let's try this one. So you can see it's looking good. So you can right click and then open image in new tab. Then you can also save image on your gallery. Also, if you scroll down, you can see many different uh, steps. After that, you can also add uh, steps to get more quality. Like that, you can also get a uh, number of images three so in future videos i may explain uh, these so make sure to subscribe so in this video we just see how to generate a images using stable diffusion in google collab in a very simple method so thanks for watching if you like this video give thumbs up subscribe the channel for more future tutorials also press the bell icon so that you can get instant notification when i upload a video thanks for watching and bye